Welcome to Carl's Aquarium. Evil puppy Bailey at all. <laughs> Talk. <laughs> How come nobody ever says that to me except when they got the camera turned on? Why are you supposed to say upside I don't know. down? I don't know. Are you sure? Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, so in the interlude what we did was uh, we got a valve here, a T here, a valve there. We're warming up a piece of uh, hose. Because you forgot the... No. Because you couldn't find the heat gun. <laughs> I never <laughs> forget anything. Okay. Okay. And what's inside a pot? Fritzy's lunch! <laughs> because the customer says... Help yourself to anything in the fridge. So I boiled one egg. See, we had to boil the water anyhow. Welcome back. Do you know what famous actor got his start on Welcome Back, Cotter? Hmm? John Travolta. He was Vinny Barbarino. A sweat hog. Mr. Cotter. Or was that the other guy? Okay, so we're almost done! In an hour and a half, we'll be out of here! We're actually sooner. Depends how fast the water is. Fast. It's got fast water? Yep. Good. Because he had to leave to go to his Mother's Day and the mother phoned him over to Happy Mother's Day. Okay, you can take your uh, egg. Well, I can't take that one while I'm holding oh. this camera. No, 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 no. That I can understand. Cut this. <clears throat> we're going to hook it onto the pump. Back where we need ya. We tease them a lot when we got them on the spot. What's the title of that song? Welcome back. Welcome back, Carter. Oh, I thought you just invented that song. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's nice to know that you think I'm so brilliant and talented that I could invent a song for a hit TV show back in the 60s. And there we go. All right, well, let's get all this crap out of here. We're going to slide it back into position. Okay. Add bye, some bye. aqua minerale. Bye. Also known as water. Okay. Bye. We got the water running in it. We filled the two corner overflows. You always fill them first because uh, you want to give it some time to set and see if you uh, have a leakage or anything before you get too carried away. But. So far, so dry! Yay, Carl! Yay, yay, rah! Carl the great, Carl the wonderful, Carl. <laughs> <laughs> okay.
Okay. Okay, so we're going to fill her up. And then before we go, we'll show you running and how everything's all boo tickety. All right. Bye-bye. What do you mean, hold on, hold on, hold okay, on? Okay, start. No, that was really good. Okay, so we're basically finished. And uh, we filled up the overflows first. And that way we got lots of time to make sure they don't leak. Um, right now we're filling the water. As soon as we get the water filled, we're going to turn the pump on, make sure everything's going, take a deep bit. Now we're looking at the quote the Big L sent them, and they wanted 400 for the installation. They wanted about 150 bucks for parts, so a total of about 550 dollars. My price, 367.50. So I'm cheaper than Big L's and far more personable. So. Uh, I thought you're not gonna fill that one. Because you have to put that water in here. No, we got to fill it to make sure it works, and then we're going to leave it running. And then when uh, the water's aged for a week or so, he's going to drain water out, then put all this oh, water okay. in. Then he's going to hook up this filter to this, and cycle the tank that way. Oh, okay. That way, there's no risk, no danger, no fuss, no muss, no error. She was born a maid. She died a maid. No hits, no runs, no errors. You never seen that one? Here lie the bones of Sophia Jones, for whom life held no terrors. She was born a maid, she died a maid. No hits, no runs, no errors. You know what's in the funeral where my dad is? No. Tombstone says, I told you I was sick. Mm -hmm. Well, apparently they were sick, they died. Okay. I told you I was sick. No one believes. <clears throat> well, apparently Mrs. Rupel if you asked her how she was, not very well. For about 85 years, she was not very well. So, he lives... Till 85, 85 years. years old. But she was never very well. Well, at least... He's birthing. She's birthing. Well, Mrs. Mount, her thing always was, I'm able to sit up and take nourishment. So one day I go there and I say hi to her and how are you doing? And she says I'm able to sit up and take nourishment. Well, that was it. See, I went to leave. I couldn't leave because the ambulance was blocking the road. She killed over dead. Okay, I'm okay. still... Bye! Okay, so we got the water in the sump. We're going to plug in the pump and see what the valves need to do. Actually, they're about even. So you want to lower that one? Or? Oh no! Lots of water movement is good. So we got the valves, we can control it if we want to, but I think that looks good. Can I turn the water up? Okay, we'll turn the water on. See how it's shoving down on the styrofoam? <clears throat> hmm? See how the styrofoam's getting compressed? Yeah. See, so you always put it on styrofoam in case things aren't perfect. See, not everything can be like me. Perfect. Yeah, all right. <laughs> what, you don't think I'm perfect? Yes, yes. So? So we got another foot to fill and then we go make other people happy. Just because okay. we show up. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, so we got her filled up. Fritzy panic. Carl, it's overflowing. Yeah, it's an overflow tank. She had me panicking. I got scared. It was pretty bad. Why this one is not full? What do you mean it's not full? 
Here. How cold is it? Oh, because the water drifts over there. Yeah, the water goes down when it gets to that level. Check. If there's a leak. Oh, I think my shoes are off. If I get wet, I know there's a leak. No, there's only dripping there. Where? This one, this one. Need to tighten, you see? Yeah, it's tight. Did you look for a second? Of course, I'm connecting everything from the back was easier when I was at the back. Turn the water off. 